I already have a gun in there. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to Mad Minute Tacticians. This week I got the opportunity to be out on Guns Out, their range here in Virginia with John with this limited edition Alien Creator. There was what, 200 of these? Well, there's, there's 500 made, but 200 coming to the US. So yes, That's 200 amazing. available in the US, isn't it though? That's yeah. pretty damn exclusive. Yeah, it's, it's super exclusive. So if you guys don't know what Alien Pistols are, you should go look them up. Just pause the video and Google Alien Pistols. They are super cool, super low reciprocating mass on the guns. So I've never shot one. I'm very excited to see how it stacks up in the world against really nice 2011s and some of those Arc Division pistols that I usually shoot. So mm -hmm. if you guys are interested in entering to win one, what is the website, John? Yeah, I mean, the whole reason we're doing this, guys, is because we want to give some of our subscribers and supporters a chance to win this very limited edition pistol. So you go to go.getintotowin.com slash gunsouttv. The link will be in the description and it's also on the bottom of the screen right now. Um, you go there, get you a limited edition collectible and you automatically get entered to win this limited edition $6,000 pistol. This thing is out of this world. It really is. Man. It, it, I mean, the, is. the materials it's made of, uh, the, like the, the the fitment of it all. And just I mean, look the at the package. This. Man. I mean, that's what I was about to say. It's this got looks... an adjustable holster with it and everything. Like, I mean, it's just it, ready it comes to go with out everything of you need, it's and amazing. you're about to play with all of this on the range. Jake. I'm excited yeah. to see what you think, man. Because you never shot an alien pistol no, before, right? I'm dying. Yeah, yeah. I'm dying. I mean, everybody knows how great the alien pistols are, but a lot of people haven't shot them. You know, they only get to see it. I mean, it makes a lot of sense, right? When you think about reciprocating mass of a slide, you yeah. got the whole slide and the optic moving yeah. backwards, creating that, you know, that momentum for the recoil. But in this particular case, you only have a part of the slide reciprocating. Yeah. The the optic, or even if it's if you're using the irons uh, part of this, um, it does, they don't move. Not nah. right. They stay yeah. in place. So I'm just very interested to see what he thinks about the recoil impulse and certain other little nuances about the pistol that I'm gonna let him find out on his own. So without further ado, guys, we're gonna go shoot this on the range. But one last time, go.getintotowin.com/gunsouttv. You have until October 27th at 11:59 p.m. Pacific Standard Time to go and get your limited edition collectible and get your chance to win this thing. And I hope when you win, you let us know. You, you DM him, DM us, email us, or something. Let us know you won because we'd love to have you on the channel yeah. to have the first shots be with Guns Out TV and if you find it through his channel, Man Minute Tacticians. So let's go. Awesome. I thought he was gonna say get some. He said awesome. But awesome. I like that. I like Groovy. It. I don't know. I don't know how this first shot's gonna be. Jacob! Don't judge me off the first shot. Jacob! All right, here we are. All right. First shots with the alien out of the holster for Jacob Tackett, Mr. Mad Minute <laughs> Tacticians in the wild. Okay, shooter's ready. Shooter's ready. You tell me when. Stand by. Hold, please. Stand by. I'm waiting, I'm waiting, I'm waiting, I'm waiting, I'm waiting, I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I think I so that was a nine-shot bill drill at 2.94 seconds. All right. So before we start shooting this, Jacob, I just want to ask you a question. Like, okay, so when you get a new gun, and, and so this is a new gun, right? Yep. And you're about to you're about to put it through its paces, so to speak, to see see what this thing is all about. Like, what is your go-to? Like, what are, what are you about to Walk me through your process. Like how do I judge it? Yeah, yeah, walk me through your process. I would say some of the first things I judge it on is fitment of the slide to the lower frame. Mm -hmm. So if you notice on like cheaper Glocks, mm -hmm. a lot of time the slide will kind of like yeah, yeah. down mm -hmm. into the frame. Mm -hmm. It's just not a, anytime you're looking at like quality firearms, especially like when you're talking about like marksmanship kind of quality, yeah. it's the tiniest little nuances that make the difference. Agreed. Um, you buy like a $4,000 22 like competition rifle, mm -hmm. most of the time all that's doing is not marring the round as it puts it into the chamber. That's what makes it so expensive. So. Right how the fitment and tolerances are. I'm really interested in how the spring feels when it comes back, yep. kind of the weight of it, but mm -hmm. also like how smooth the slide is and how like polished and just taking care of all the internals are. Yep. Obviously the trigger. The next thing I'm worried about is how the gun points. Yeah. So like just its natural pointability, different guns kind of land in a different place. Like Agreed. your subcompact guns, yep. I find typically land kind of high and left. Yep. Um, so this Why one- Why is that? I mean, you know what? That's a it's a weird. Of, it's a grip thing. We'll talk about it in the EDC episode. But yep. Anyway, it's a grip thing. Uh -huh. um, but natural pointability is a big one to me, and this one lands like perfect, kind of high center mass when I'm looking at a equally, a, you know, equal height target. Yep. 
So pointability and everything is on point. Um, and then the next thing I do is send a mag in it and see kind of that cant and yep. what the gun wants from me as far as like reloading it. Right. Um, and that's kind of my, I don't want to call it dry fire procedure. Yeah. But figuring out how the gun likes to have that magazine presented to itself. And then I'm, I feel pretty comfortable ready to run rounds through it after that. Yeah, so. yeah. Yeah, so you dry fired this already extensively, yes. I saw. So like, what, what, are you, what are your thoughts after dry firing it alone? I will say that the slide feels really stiff. Okay. Uh, like comparatively to some of the nicer striker fired stuff that I typically mm -hmm. run or the 2011 stuff that you run, mm -hmm. it's definitely a lot, it's a lot stiffer. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. But I feel like probably for good reason. Right, There's right. There's very little mass that's mm -hmm. moving, mm -hmm. so it's got to have a pretty thick spring to catch it. Right. That's at least surface of my head. That's what yeah. I'm thinking it's going to do. Yeah. So. Oh, that's a good assessment. I like that. But okay. it's extremely smooth. The trigger is extremely, extremely crisp. Isn't it precise? It is. Like, I feel like it's very precise. There's like no wasted movement in there at all. No, and I don't mind. The trigger doesn't have to be light. Right. What we right. want is crisp. Crisp, yeah, yeah. The, the difference between two and four pounds, can mm -hmm. you equate that with your finger? Can you pull your finger four pounds versus two pounds? Like... I feel like we worry about that too much. I honestly think I can, guys, because you know I got I got I got pistol trigger weights all from from one point two to like all the way to four point four. So, yeah, yeah. Yeah, the thing that matters to me the most is that there's no creep in it. Once yeah, I get there it to is that no wall, creep. it breaks. Yeah, yeah, it, that, that so. thing breaks every single time. All right, it feels well, like a monster, dude. Oh, what do you think about the dot? I, I like it. I right? like it. And it's a really tidy, like, one MOA. It looks like it's one MOA. Yeah, yeah. I know that that's not the popular, mm -hmm. like, choice. Mm -hmm. And I don't know why people like six I, MOA. I but. personally think that you can get a one MOA, and if you need a bigger dot, you just crank it up. Yeah, just blow it out. You just blow, just it, blow it out. out. And if I take a six, and yeah. I'm trying to adjust for sun. Yeah, yeah, you're stuck. Now I've got a 12. Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't make any sense to me. Agreed. So. All right. All right, man. I'm not going to hold you. Okay. I know you're right. ready. Look, look, look. I I'm was, dying. I, was, I know, man. I was keep The suspense is killing me. They made right. me wait at the gate for an hour. All yeah. right. We're not going to talk about <clears throat> that. We're not going to talk about that. And then, and then, and then he wants to talk to me about the gun before I shoot. <laughs> <laughs> All right. First shot. Jacob, take it. Oh. Uh, yeah. You, I got to look at the camera, not John. Uh, <laughs> it's real good. That, Doesn't that, that mag just go quick? It does. It That's does, what really we does. were saying the entire time. It was like, dude, it's like one mag. It might as well be five rounds in that thing. It just shoots so. It shoots so flat. I'm. 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 You, you, I'm used to catching. You're used to driving, yeah. right? So I threw. I threw two or saw, three high. Yeah. Because I'm trying to under driving it and then having to bring it back up because it's not. I'm not yeah. getting any muzzle flip out of it at all. Yeah. This thing's amazing. Go ahead, man. Okay. All right. Go ahead. Go ahead. Feed that thing. Feed it. Oh, I don't know how you shoot this slow. I say what now? I don't know how you shoot this slow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you can't. You also, do. both both mags that I sent in sent the slide home without me hitting the slide release. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. I'm a fan. Gee, bro, I could have swore you only had half a mag there. Look, look, if you can afford, if you can afford to buy this, and you don't win one of the 200 that's imported, if you can afford to buy this, just know that you're gonna have a bunch of ammo costs. Oh so, man, I'm telling you, this, there's no like, way you're shooting it slow. It's like, and this is 17. So it, it says 16 plus, well, 17 plus here. Yeah, which is mm, like two maybe. I, I don't even know. I, I think honestly, like two I, base pads. E either way, whether it's 17 or whether it's 19, it feels like eight. All right, so all right, so you, so you, so, you, so now you know what the gun is gonna do. What do you what do you want to do? How do how do how do I, we? I'd like to see splits on it. You want to see some splits? Yeah. You want to run some Did timer it? on it? Okay, you got there a timer. It is. Yep. All right, so we'll we'll see what the splits are. Um, you want to draw from holster with it? Uh, yeah. I don't know if that's gonna. It, it, it'll go on, go on your belt. belt. You have to cinch it down really really tight. Can you cinch that belt down? To, oh, you know what? Here, we'll just switch belts real quick. Guns out TV first. There you go. You want the, you got the mighty Ruckus on Tori on that one right there, baby. Wow. That's awesome. I'm not going to put this belt on. I feel like it might do something to my soul if I put this belt on, Jacob. I like that buckle. I don't know if I've ever worn a belt like this. Boy, you, boy, see, see, now this, uh, this, this belt, 
Boy, you catch a whipping with this thing. So Jeez. it has a thin piece of metal that runs through the inside of it. It's Are you a, serious? Yeah, it's an Alien Gear concealment holster. Wait, I, wait, 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 I'm wait, 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 like... wait, 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 wait. This is an EDC belt? Yeah. E but you put the buckle on here. I put the buckle on, but you could put anything. It comes with a regular belt buckle, right? But you could put any belt buckle on it. I've had that for like 10 years too, every day, and it, that's the shape that it looks. It looks great. That's actually not bad for 10 years, no, Jacob. I wore this every day in the Army. Wow. Cav right. Scouts, we kind of do that's what we want. That's interesting. So I wore a leather belt every day. All right. A little, little something extra, guys. Don't tell my old Sergeant Major. <laughs> okay, shooter's ready. Shooter's ready. You tell me when. Stand by. Hold, please. Stand by. I think I so that was a nine-shot bill drill at 2.94 seconds, and your best split was 0.19. Okay, we got to speed it up then. You had a bunch of those, though. You're, you're consistent. Look at that. You had, out of nine shots, let me see. We've got to get in the shade here. One, two, three, four, five of your nine shots was at 0.19. All right, we'll speed it up. That was after you got into a groove, we'll I guess. We'll speed it up. All right. Going again, Jacob. Okay, shoot six. Shoot six, Sir Michael six. Jr. Six. Shooter ready. Shooter ready. Stand by. <laughs> yep. Eight. <laughs> Two point four nine seconds. What was, what was the six shot time? The six shot time? Oh, oh the six shot time is 2.12. Oh, no, we could do better than that. Yeah, I know we can. 2.12, uh, best split, 0.15, and there's only one of those. We'll just put six rounds in it this time, and then we don't have to count. You're right. That's what I have to do with Sir Michael. <laughs> That's what I have to do with Sir Michael. <laughs> 2.16 with a 0.17 is your best split. Six shots. How it's, many do you think hit? There was like five. Yeah, right? I'm, five? Th I'm throwing one. It's me. Oh, it's, it's okay. It's me. Oh, man, you got me. All right, all right. I, I got to do I, I got to do This thing is capable of going way faster than that. Oh, yeah. Like, I, like, it definitely, I'm not making excuses, but. It's okay. Not not knowing the trigger and, like, getting used to it, but well, I, I'm consistently pulling, like, what? Like, 0 0.17, 0 0.19 splits? Ish. Ish. It's uh, we have a 0 0.22 in here. 0 0.19, 0 0.17. Yeah, not bad. Average. Average 0.17. All right, okay. Got that out of the way. Yes. Let's switch belts, and I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do those. You got me. You got me hungry for some bills. All right. All right. Let's get if to it. If he beats me on the bill drill, it's only because he knows the gun. So excuses out front. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Have you and Sir Michael hung out lately? I I watch. <laughs> I'm I'm running a house on our mine. Five oh seven C. You know. I'm gonna get rid of this. I'm just gonna leave it at that. So anyway, leave it alone, guys. So anyway, I have it. It works. Yeah, for, yeah, it works. Okay, I guess. Yeah, I, I mean, I listen. Like it. And I, I noticed this when we do it dur during the drills. Mm -hmm. The window is not large. I would have been better off just running this iron. It, it does. I know some people because it's cheap, and it I was given this. You know. Okay. I, all right. We're going down a rabbit hole here. I know. Okay. This thought sucks. Time to shoot the bill drill. Hold on. Actually, I'm gonna record this with my glasses. Oh man, you get so many cameras. I know, right? So many, so many angles. That one doesn't, that one doesn't count. Ooh. That same on your splits, 0 0.19, 0 0.19, 0 0.18. We're what's, both consistent what's on the total splits, time? Uh, total time is 2.5. 2.5. Damn, that was But slow. you counted. Huh? You counted. I did count. So. You, could you tell? Yeah, yeah. All right, hold on. I'm going to do one more. Tell you what, you're consistent though. 225, a little bit, no, yeah, you're 0 0.19, 0 0.2, 0 0.19, 0.22. You had one that was like oddly slow, but you're very consistent yeah, it, with I, it was, I think it was the second shot. Oh, I wish I had the timer going on those. All right. Those were oh. good splits. Had, have the timer going. It does seem though like the gun kind of wants to shoot a 0.19. Like I've noticed, like different triggers, different guns kind of have like a happy. Uh, that happy. Seems okay, to be let's, happy let's, there. let's see. Let's just see from the. Let's just see. I'm gonna just run it. Okay. All right. All right. Shooter ready. Yep. Stand by. Mm. 
got you literally the same all the way through the board. I think your fastest was a 0.17. Mm -hmm. So you're literally 0.17 to 0.19 all the way through all yeah. those, every single split. So yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Your best split was a 0.15. 0.15. Uh, I'm just interested I've... to see if I can get it under a 0.19 split now. Hmm. I mean, you have. You already got it on 0.15. That was your best. Yeah, but I want to like consistent. I want to run like. What is your normal consistency? It depends on what I'm shooting, but with a decent trigger, decent gun, I can usually pull like anywhere from like 0.14 to 0.16 usually, mm -hmm. which we're talking about hundredths of a second. But yeah. those hundredths, they stack up, they matter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fastest split, 0.16. You got that twice out of, uh, let me see. Looks like, yeah, twice out of uh, seven shots. Kai, I can't count. I was trying to shoot six. Oh, no, it's okay. <laughs> okay. Seven shots. God. Yeah, you suck. Uh, 0.17, and that's four out of your seven shots. So I'm, It's coming down. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I want to see at least like a couple 0.15s. I'm All just right. going to stand on it, and if All I miss, right. I miss. But Let's I want to see it run like fast. see what you got. All right. <clears throat> She's ready. ready. Stand by. Nine shots, best shot, 0.16, and that was one out of the nine. Man, I don't yeah. know, it seems to be happy, that 0.17 to like 0.19 range, mm -hmm. it seems to be happy running there. Yeah. Which is plenty fast enough. I thought I could do it with one finger, clearly my finger's not strong enough. You reseat the star faster than anybody that I know. Talent. I Comes think that's many you shapes just get stuff. in there and you just get all knuckly with it. Just get just, in there and just man stuff. Get all knuckly. Just doing man stuff. We need a chain, some two by fours. Knuckly. Some nail guns. And a mustache. We should shoot this with a nail gun. Man stuff. <laughs> all okay. right. Here we are. Shooter ready. One more time. Stand by. Ready. Guys, all right, so that's first impressions with the Alien Creator. I, I gotta say, if there's only 500 that are being made and there's only 200 that are coming into the country, just being able to watch the video is like exciting. The fact that I got to come out here and put some rounds to this thing today, like John, I, I appreciate it. That was oh, bro. super awesome. Bro, you're super always awesome. welcome, so, man. Uh, like first impressions, kind of final thoughts on it. It's definitely a unique gun. It lives in a category all of its own. I feel like the competition world is where it's gonna be the happiest, but Man, I, I mean, you could definitely EDC it if you wanted to. You know, if you, <laughs> you wanted to spend that much, you could. You keep going this thing, bro. I, I don't know that anyone even... Oh, okay, all right. Let, so let's, here's let's, the no, argument. No, no, no. no, no. Okay. I'm going to stop you right there. You're really going to EDC a $6,000 yeah, exotic pistol that if you got to pull this out and defend yourself, you may never see it again? How valuable because, is your life? Oh, my gosh. You so even if, the, even if they take it from you... Also, I'm going to say this right now. Alien would probably... <laughs> that was good. Well played. Well played. But All right. For for real, it is it is for like an everyday carry. It is a little heavy. Uh, I my only my only gripe mm -hmm. is that we didn't have any malfunctions today. But I'd love to see like a malfunction get solved with it. You know Especially what? Especially like a double feed or something kind of complicated. Right. Right. It's so I wonder. If, I wonder slide. if that's a plus to the pistol. Like that. There's so, they happen so few and far in between. I mean, we've never really experienced malfunction. We're not with the first one or with this one. Yeah, and usually if you're gonna see it, it's gonna be, you're gonna see the most of your flaws in like the first 500 rounds. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, it's just such a, it's way more rugged than you'd think it. You would think you need to baby it, but you don't. It's yeah. super solid. You just, you know, shoot it, lay it down, go, and you come back, pick it up, and just run it some more. That's what I'm saying. I'm saying like it, my argument for my stuff is always like, would I EDC this? Uh -huh. And it doesn't have manual thumb safeties. It seems extremely reliable. It shoots very well. It's super accurate. You could, you definitely could. So are you gonna get a limited edition collectible? And Yes. Yeah. No, I think you should. Sir Michael said he's gonna buy like dozens. Yeah. And I'll, I believe him. I'll, I'll buy one for him then. <laughs> That's not gonna get you the entry though. He gets 12, <laughs> I get 11. You say you're gonna buy one. Yeah, the gun. Are you talking about collectibles? I'm gonna buy a gun. <laughs> Turn my wrong. Oh, you, you're just gonna go get the gun? Yeah. That's the way to do it. But guys, if you can't afford the gun, 
you can win this gun by getting a limited edition collectible and supporting your favorite gun channels, supporting a veteran owned small business in getintertowin.com by going to go.getintertowin.com slash gunsouttv. Get your limited edition collectible, get your entry to win, and hopefully we'll see you on the range with a brand new alien pistol, one of 200 they got shipped to the States, all right? Listen, your last chance to win October 27th, 11.59 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Don't forget to set your clock, set your timers. Don't wait that long, personally. Get in there, get as many collectibles as you can, get as many entries as you can. Try to win this thing, because I'm telling you, man, it's, it's limited. Even if you got the money to buy it, you might not be able to buy it. Yeah, I mean, honestly. Yeah. There's only 200 coming into the States. Yeah. Yeah, you know there's there's well over Your only 200. chance might be You know there's it. well over 200 ballers oh, yeah. that's going after this oh, thing, yeah. right? I appreciate you having this and us on your channel. I and I appreciate you. the fact that we were able to bring this to you and let you Absolutely run not. it, man, because you ran it. You ran it, bro. I'm, I'm excited for whoever the lucky winner is to come out here and smoke our time on that star. <laughs> that stupid star was harder than I thought it would be. It's gonna, not that hard. Man, I got a 392 on that thing, but that's with my gun. So we got to do it with your gun and then see. So we'll do yeah, that. Yeah, there, there we go. We'll do that. All right. All right. Thanks for having me on, man. Yeah, absolutely, John. Thanks for being here. All right. That's it. I always just run away at the end of the video. Is it? Is that what you do? Yeah. So you just run away.